Good day everyone, welcome to video tutorials presentation on 3D Studio Max adding texture to terrain. Now let's take a look at the 3D Max program itself. Okay, we will now add the material to the terrain. So let's click on material editor, click press the letter M to open material editor. Click on make sure you select the material you want to assign this uh click on the object you want to assign material to, click on assign material to selection button, then click on show map in viewport. Then click on the diffuse map button, double click bitmap, then select a suitable uh, map to use. Let's say I select tree bark, so double click on that. Now we right click on the top viewport, select F, press F3, you can see the material in the top viewport. Now let's go click on go to parent, scroll down a bit, click on maps button. Click on the opacity map button and we double click gradient map. We're gonna adjust transparency. So this part is transparent because of the black color here. This part is opaque because of the white color here. Let's click here, right click and then select edit properties. Then the color here. Make the color closer to the white. Close this, close this. Right click here, select edit properties, let's click on the color again, change the color to a bit closer to black, then close this, close this, move this around a bit, then scroll down a bit, select fractal, select amount 1, levels, let's select 10. Fractal is important for making uh, for making randomized, making the transparency or the gradient a bit more randomized, like you see in this case. Okay, now we right click on the left viewport, select shift and move, drag it down. Okay, this will make a copy. Make okay, it okay. Let's change the position of x axis, change this to minus 1, then press enter. Now we select a different material slot, click on assign material to selection, click on show map in viewport. This will assign a, a new map or new material to the underlying copy of the object, then click on diffuse map button, double click bitmap, let's select a different map or picture, let's select from ground, let's uh, double click grass 2, then go to parent, right click on the top viewport, you can see the texture here, let's close the material editor, right click on the perspective view, you can see the texture here, click on the render button, and you see the rendering of the terrain with texture. Okay, so thank you very much.